नमस्कार माई सेल्फ उमा शंकर दास वेलकम टू द डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग ऑफ इंडिया मेट्रोलॉजिकल डिपार्टमेंट ड्यूरिंग दिस ब्रीफिंग विल डिस्कस अबाउट द पास्ट ट्वेंटी फोर आवर वेदर्स एंड द करेंट वेदर सिस्टम एंड व्हाट विल बी इट्स इम्पैक्ट इन कमिंग डेज इफ यू लुक एट ड्यूरिंग पास्ट ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स पर्टिकुलरली फॉक कंडीशन ऑब्जर्व ओवर पार्ट्स ऑफ पंजाब एंड हिमाचल प्रदेश एंड अमृतसर इन पर्टिकुलर रिकॉर्डेड जी वेजिबिलिटी of zero meter apart from that himachal pradesh bilaspur also reported uh, 50 meter of visibility if you talk about the temperature the, there is no significant change in the minimum temperature across the country during past 24 hours a particularly minimum temperature continue to be above normal by 3 to 5 degree over parts of jammu kashmir uh, ladakh gilgit baluchistan muzaffarabad uttar pradesh himachal pradesh uh, uttarakhand northwest rajasthan bihar jharkhand and by 2 to 3 degree over southwest rajasthan north gujarat east madhya pradesh and near normal over rest of the rest parts of the country and today's lowest minimum temperature was recorded uh, of 13.2 that is over the mandla of east madhya pradesh over the plains of country if you look at the highlight is of, of the today's uh, uh, briefing is a low pressure area likely to form over southwest bay of bengal during next 24 hours under its influence we are anticipating isolated heavy rainfall activity likely over tamil nadu during 11th to 17th over andhra pradesh during 11th to 14th kerala during 13th to 17th and south in interior karnataka during 13th to 15th november 2024 if also a fresh western disturbance is likely to affect the western himalayan region from 14th of november synoptic condition is as follows the, the cyclonic circulation that over southwest bengal now persists over the same region and extend now it's extending up to 5.8 km above mean sea level tilting southwest toward highest today morning at 8:30 hours of ist and under its influence we are anticipating a low pressure area likely to form over the same region during next 24 hours there after it is likely to move slowly nearly westward towards tamil nadu and silonga coast during subsequent two days apart from that that the, the yesterday stop that is uh, now running runs from the above cyclonic circulation over southwest bay of bengal to uh, west central bay of bengal of north coastal andhra pradesh and extends up to 1.5 km above mean sea level apart from that a fresh western disturbance seen as a trough in middle uh, tropospheric coastal is with its axis at 5.8 km above mean sea level runs roughly along 70 degree east to the north of uh, latitude 30 degree 32 degree north and if another fresh west wd is likely to affect western himalaya region from uh, 14th november so forecast uh, if you look at the temperature forecast as of now there is no significant change in minimum temperature very likely over northwest and central india during next 4 to 5 days and no significant change in minimum temperature very likely over east india during next two days however we are anticipating gradual fall by 3 to 4 degree thereafter for subsequent 3 days over eastern part of the country if you like the uh, weather warning particularly for uh, dense to very dense, dense fog uh, uh, punjab area has, uh, some parts of punjab were anticipating uh, dense to very dense fog likely over punjab and uh, dense fog over uh, himalaya during next um, for punjab during next 3 days and for himalaya during next uh, himachal pradesh during next 5 days apart from that we are uh, anticipating thunderstorm activity likely to continue Uh, over some parts of uh, coastal andhra pradesh tamil nadu royal sima and uh, during next 4 to 5 days and heavy rainfall activity likely uh, on 11th particularly we are anticipating heavy rainfall activity over coastal andhra pradesh and uh, over uh, tamil nadu region and 12th we are also anticipating over royal sima and uh, um, coast andhra pradesh region heavy rainfall will very likely at isolated pockets and over uh, tamil nadu also there is possibility of heavy rainfall activity on 13th the heavy rainfall li- spread likely to uh, increase and uh, particularly andhra pradesh royal sima uh, south interior karnataka uh, tamil nadu and kerala they are likely to get heavy rainfall activity that is rainfall amounting 7 to 11 cm at isolated pockets also on 14th there heavy rainfall likely over andhra pradesh tamil nadu uh, then kerala and south interior karnataka on 15th we are anticipating that heavy rainfall activity likely over kerala and tamil nadu on 16th also the over the same region likely to continue on 17th the heavy rainfall uh, the uh, spell likely to continue over kerala and tamil nadu so thank you very much you can connect with us through the social media platform like x youtube 
uh, Facebook and Instagram. Also, you can connect through us uh, directly through the Mosom website, imd.gov.in. Thank you.